Hi, I'm Magda from Portuguese with Magda. Today we are talking about five things that foreigners need to know about Brazilian behavior. Uh, and the first one is the behavior of Brazilians. Brazilians are well known for their cordiality and good humor, a reputation which is fact is true. Of course, there are exceptions as they are bad manners everywhere. But in Brazil, people who come from outside are usually treated very well. This is absolutely normal. It's like you are a freshman student or a new employee at the company and they feel it's their duty to introduce you to everyone they meet. Another important point which many foreigners still find strange is the display of affection in public. Don't be surprised, for example, if a person you've just met greets you with two kisses and a hug. If you are walking down the street or in a bar, you are likely to see a couple of lovers exchange affection or friends who greet each other with hugs when they see each other. Believe me, around here, this is normal. Brazilians in general always try to help as, as they can. Don't be not surprised by some peculiarities of these natives, like me. In countries like in the, the USA or those on the European continent, people are more reserved, while here in Brazil, the opposite happens. Brazilians are more receptive and try to fit in with their own friends, parents, uncles, cousins, grandparents, in short, with the whole family. Number two, service in stores. If you enter a, a store and an employee promptly appears at your side to serve you, do not be alarmed. In most Brazilian stores, it's customary for the attendants to greet you the first time you step into the establishment. Foreigners who are not used to it may feel uncomfortable, but this is not done to embarrass them. They are just following the company's regulations. And this, by the way, is a kind of a standard in practically all Brazilian stores. Number three, Brazilian punctuality. It's not a good thing to say, but a characteristic for which Brazilians are known is their punctuality, or rather, the lack of it. It is not intentional, but the native doesn't care much about schedules. For some, the important thing is to get there, even if late. So, if someone makes an appointment with you and say it's coming, add at least another hour. If the schedule is for 3 p.m., he, can, he or she can ease easily arrive at 3.30. You can be sure that you will still wait, especially if you have more than one person involved. Number four, birthday parties. Birthday parties in Brazil can be a little different from what you usually see, especially if you were for a country where people are more reserved. In some places, these celebrations are more or less the following. Friends get to gather together at the birthday person's house and then decide which club to go to that night. In the case of the older ones, they usually do something at home just for the people closest to them. In Brazil, things change a little bit. There will be practically the two things mentioned above only in the same place, the birthday boy's house. There you'll find 
music, drinks, food, and everything that a typical Brazilian birthday is entitled to. And don't be surprised if, you, if your third cousin is at the party, as it's very common to invite the whole family. Guests range from grandparents to the boss, passing through co-workers. Our Brazil comes down to exactly these three items, samba, carnival, and football. When you arrive there, you see that the country is much more than that. Brazil is the fifth largest nation in the world. The world. Uh, all the Europe fits in its extension. Therefore, to summarize it to a few characteristics, it is not to take into account its great diversity. Each state has its own peculiarities. Depending on the place you visit, you can find a bit of German, Italian, or African culture. The seasons of the year are not marked, but in the South region, it is possible to find a, temp a temperature below zero in winter while in the northeast at the same time of the year thermometers can ease reach more than 30. people in brazil don't party all the time they also work study pay countless bills and one of the higher taxes in the world brazilians have duties to fulfill even with all the political, economic, and social, social problems in the country, they try to move forward. So if you like this type of information, please subscribe, like, and share this information with other people. And also, I am offered a program for you to learn Brazilian Portuguese. You will speak as a native speaker. Please, um, Contact me in the link in the description and let's learn Brazilian Portuguese. See you soon. Bye-bye.